what's up so today I'm going to show you how you can go from having extremely tightly textured hair to stretching your hair like so without heat to get a nice fluffy and voluminous twist out like this which is super easy to achieve without adding damage to your hair and I'm super excited to be partnering with Curidu to show you how so if you're unfamiliar with Curidu it's basically a convenient handheld steamer you can use it in tons of different ways you can use it to refresh your hair after a wash and go you can use it to rehydrate your hair you can use it to add steam to your hair while you're deep conditioning you can use it to detangle your hair you can use it to add volume but in this video I'm going to show you how I use it to stretch my hair to get the look of a blowout without actually having to blow dry my hair so Curidu actually has this really nice gift set that you can purchase for the holidays. It's going to be going on sale on Black Friday. It comes pre-packaged just like this, which makes it really easy and gift ready. Inside, you'll get the Curidu, which is the handheld steamer. You'll also get a nice microfiber towel from Curidu. You'll get this really nice Curidu detangling brush, which is actually one of my favorite brushes right now. It also comes with a water-resistant Curidu storage bag that you can use for traveling. It's big enough to hold the Q Redu and your hair tools. And it also comes with a Kiridu 9 ounce lemongrass and basil scented candle. This is almost like a self care box for your hair. <laughs> so let's jump into the tutorial. The first thing that you have to do before using the Kiridu is to remove the little pocket to add water for the steamer. Kiridu actually comes with a little toggle like this where you fill it up with water and then you can easily squeeze it into the capsule. After filling it with water and placing it back into the machine, you have to plug it up and then you'll notice there's a little blinking red light once the light stops blinking then that means the cure do is ready to use once the light stops blinking there's a little button on the inside that you squeeze and then when you squeeze it you'll notice that the steam comes out of the other side so now we're all ready to start stretching literally all you have to do is glide the steam through your hair my hair is freshly washed right now but it is a hundred percent dry so that makes it easier for me to use the tension method to use the steam to stretch my hair out. The more you pull on it and you allow the steam to stretch out your curls, the more you'll start to get that blow dried effect. This is actually my first time trying this on my short hair because I wasn't really sure like how long my hair was. Um, you know when you have super tight curls, you don't really think that you can do certain styles because your hair looks so short. But once I stretched it out and I saw how much length I had, I was actually blown away. And the fact that you can do this without applying heat to your hair is even better. I know that a lot of us struggle to do twist outs or even do wash and goes on really tightly textured hair. But with this, it makes it easy to stretch the hair out to make it easier to twist. And of course, it makes the hair appear longer and fuller. So I'm just going to let you guys watch my hair transform. Then I'll come back to explain the twisting process. So here's my hair after fully stretching it out. As you guys can see, my hair looks so much longer when it's stretched out than it does in its wash and go state. So to twist my hair, I'm going to use the Shea Moisture Intensive Hydration Twist and Defining Custard. This is my go-to twisting cream. You guys can see this is a brand new jar because I literally ran out from when I used to do twist outs. I've already started doing some of them. Um, I'm just going to quickly show you guys how I like to flat twist my hair. So I kind of part my hair in like medium sized sections because since it is stretched out it makes it really easier for me to part my hair. Plus the bigger the sections the more volume I'll have. So what I do is I kind of start with the small section first and then I just continue to add hair as I go down the twist. Almost like a corn roll but not as hard as a corn roll. I just go all the way down the twist until it's at the bottom and I always like to add some extra product at the end and twist my finger around to help add that curl to the end of the twist so I'm just going to repeat that same exact process until my entire head is twisted
So now, even though my hair is dry, I'm still going to sit under a hooded dryer just to make sure that my hair stays nice and tight and in place. I really like this portable dryer from Glow By Day. You basically put one end of the dryer on any blow dryer, and then once you turn it on, the air will cause it to start blowing up, and then you'll just sit under it like a regular hooded dryer. I'm just going to sit under this for about 30 minutes or so since like I said my hair is dry I'm just doing this to make sure that it really stays nice and in place typically I like to leave my twist in overnight but for the sake of this video I just sat under the dryer for 30 minutes I did my makeup and then I took it off so now I'm just going to gently unravel my twist I actually didn't add any oil to my fingers the way I usually do but I didn't really feel like I needed it when I unraveled the first twist my hair felt super soft and it was defined so I just went ahead and did the rest of my hair. So to add some volume to this twist out, I just took my pick and I fluffed out my roots. It's really important to not rub the pick all the way through so that way you don't mess up the definition at the end of the twist. So after picking and fluffing and picking and fluffing until my hair was in the shape that I liked, this is my end result. And this was actually my first time doing a twist out on stretched hair since I've been growing out my hair. So I was really surprised to see how much length I had. I was really happy with it. I have other videos on my channel showing the other uses of the q redo but I really do love it for stretching out my hair. I will link the holiday gift set down below for you guys to purchase. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And hopefully I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye.